Welcome back to another vlog. Hello, back in London. Today is 1st September. I actually got back to London from my travels and from Czech Republic and Croatia a few days ago. And I thought I'm gonna start a vlog. I've just been to my hairdresser. As always, I'm happy to link it down below. They always do a really, really good job and I'm about to meet my Trenitka. And in this vlog, I just wanna basically film for a few days. Um, I think school starts on Wednesday. I had a bit of hurdle because on Friday evening, I got an email that Nessa's nursery is closing. So the whole weekend I spent emailing nurseries. I'll be probably viewing some nurseries, not something I want to film. I'm not sure, obviously, for <laughs> obvious reasons. <laughs> I'm not going to basically be filming that, but just thought I'm going to throw it in that. Um, it's just been very, very stressful for me, I'm not going to lie. Uh, so today I want to just enjoy myself, and in this vlog, I want to also show you some new bits. Uh, from Cezanne and Jenny Kane. I've got for autumn and transitional period. So let's start this vlog guys. If you're new around here I would love it if you hit the subscribe button and let's enjoy the day. Korean beauty store. Look at looking at some ideally masks. Welcome to another day, guys. So yesterday I had the nicest day catching up with. I was catching up with Hitka, and this morning I am basically trying to focus on self care, which I've always been. But I am doing uh, this series on TikTok called Self Timber, basically. Just committing myself to do something for my self-care every day. So I've done a Pilates class, 30 minutes at home, uh, moved with Renniko, which is definitely my number one channel when it comes to Pilates and bear classes. And I think she does a bit of yoga as well. And then I did 10 minutes on the cross trainer. And then um, I followed with my infrared sauna. I still have got a running discount code, guys, for any current body products, which is EVA10. I really, really love the sauna. It feels really, really good, especially after the workout, kind of the prolonging, the sweating. Um, they say you also burn calories. Now, I don't do it for that. I do it mainly just for the relaxation of the muscles, um, some recurring injuries and kind of basically sweating, getting the toxins out of the body. I have had uh, basically a massive shocker on Friday, uh, a Friday night or evening. We got... Um, a letter from the nursery that my nursery is closing so i am not gonna lie i have been very stressed trying to go view new series getting everything last minute but the prices of the basically nurseries in this area is ridiculous um and also the times are not as flexible as this nursery was basically nessa was that firstly the nursery was very close so it was like a five minute walk from Liam's school and the other nurseries make my life very complicated because they all start at eight and that just doesn't suit us so that means to leave very early because they're much further and then to stand outside of the school so I and considering I also have to pay for it I really really need to I, I still hoping that I'm gonna find um you know a childcare one to two days a week just to help me with work and workload and also help Nessa with socializing and speech but let's see at the moment it's very stressful um so all i've been focusing all the whole weekend is basically searching for nurseries and trying to understand their fees their structure um you know trying to basically see what could work for me my lifestyle and Liam's school the most but as I promised, I have got um, a Cezanne order, which I wanted to share with you. I'm also going to be filming it for TikTok. So I need to get my head around and see what works at the best. Uh, but yeah, let's take it from there and let's open what I have. Guys, so as promised, I wanted to show you a few bits I got from Cezanne and one more skirt. So I've received, this was a bronze gift, a really, really stunning skirt. I'm going to show you guys on the side. I just filmed it for TikTok. A really, really beautifully made skirt tailored skirt which would be great for the office or for very kind of chic outfit it's kind of asymmetric midi skirt i think these look so beautiful with heels or when you just have got like boots 
I'm wearing it with um, kind of shorter boots, but I, I love when you have like a tall boot, different colors, different textures, and just to wear it on a lot of occasion. It's kind of kind of that dress up, dress down type of skirt. I absolutely adore the fit. I got it in a size medium. And as always, I'm gonna link it down below. I can't remember the price, but really lovely brand. They've got a lot of nice kind of pieces that could work for women that love tailoring, that wanna look chic um, or cool, because uh, they have got some, some of the pieces are quite cool. Um, and want to kind of create a bit of capsule wardrobe as well, make it work for date nights, make it work for office as well. So this is um, the first item. Please guys, everything is going to be linked below. I'm going to also link my hairdresser, but the first item from Cezanne is a skirt that I actually have got already in a brown version. Last year, I got basically this in the brown version and they've had this for some time and I think it's really really underrated. I decided to get it in a larger size. I've been eating a little bit way too much over holidays um, but also um, now when I've tried it on I could have gone for the size 10. It would be fine but I now like that this feels longer. Very often I get a, l a larger size just because in a lot of the things I prefer oversized like even slip dresses I prefer oversized. Uh, but also it helps me with the length. I'm 5'11", 180 centimeters, so it's always good to get a little bit longer, especially when it comes to meniscus. I just love this is asymmetric um, and I love navy. I love navy, burgundy, kind of deep greens. I love neutrals, especially now with autumn coming and winter. So absolutely love this skirt and decided finally to get it. I think it's going to look so amazing with knits, shirts, t-shirts, with the kind of a lot of um, the jackets and trenches. I think it's going to look absolutely beautiful. And obviously, I should mention also that the brown one is also in stock. So I'm going to link that as well. That's also beautiful color. So maybe if you're not a navy fan, you will like the brown one. And the next item are these boots. I am in love. I had an eye on a different pair. I um, obviously I have got some suede boots already. You may remember if you're if you're um, a regular, I have got several kind of pair of cowboy boots in suede just from Zara. But oh my god, when I saw these, the color, how tall they are, the shape, oh my god, I fell in love. So I quickly forgot about the other ones but i'm going to link the other ones as well so you kind of guys if you're not a cowboy boot person those ones are not cowboy boots they're kind of a cowboy boot cousin but they're not cowboy boots they're plain they don't have any of these ornaments um i think the shape is slightly different i think they're flatter they don't have this heel but i'm obsessed what how these fit i'm absolutely in love i love it with the skirt it's got a look great with so many things jeans the smell ah oh, i am obsessed so guys i'm gonna link these as well this is my second pair of uh shoes from cezanne i'm in love i really hope i can wear them as much as possible and yeah they're gonna be comfortable my first pair is comfortable i have got the um the loafers quite chunky loafers very very happy with them but oh my god i just need to protect these um with a special spray just to kind of maintain them in case it starts to rain but i'm absolutely obsessed well i'm gonna give a shout out to the mask i got yesterday so yesterday um i just love these days i normally don't get many of these days and if the nursery is not gonna work out i probably won't get many of these days at all until um basically she can get funded hours and i secure nursery from december when nessa's gonna turn three but yes i was never a huge fan to go to the hairdresser until basically my hairdresser started to schedule me for Sundays and I know my husband can be with the kids and I, I usually make it a day, I make it special. I don't spend there all day, but then I give myself one to two hours just to do lovely things. Yesterday I met with my friend Itka, who's Czech and actually it was very handy to meet her because she brought me something from Czech Republic. When I was back home, I always bring our Amazon Fire Stick um despite my parents have their own one but i just prefer i'm so lazy we don't need it at home i bring it there i plug it in all the logins are there i don't like to do the logins 
I just don't like to deal with it. You know, I plug it in, there it is there, and my kids can watch whatever they want. I can watch whatever we like. And as always, with all the stress, I forgot. I, I only took the remote control and I left it at home. So my sister sent it to my friend Ivka that was still basically in Czech Republic and she brought it with me and met me yesterday. So two birds with one stone, we had a lovely time. We went to um, Soho House for lunch. I'm trying to do, as I said, kind of self-September. That doesn't mean I'm not gonna have cheat days or anything like that, but I wanna um, do as many days as possible intermittent fasting. I think it agrees with me. The, you know, the bloating is gone and the stomach feels flatter. And at the moment, I just don't feel like I want to diet or anything, but I'm definitely going to be back on regular workouts and just do a lot of self-care because I feel September is one of those months that for me, it almost is like a bit of like January because we have got still months left um, until the end of the year. We can turn things around and I feel like after the break, after I just indulge, it's time just basically to go and just look after my body more and just watch what goes into my body, you know, review my vitamins, review my fitness, review my skincare and just basically start fresh. I often have kind of, I review also my goals, what I wanted to achieve and so on. So basically I started this series on TikTok. If you, on TikTok, if you guys don't follow me, it's Eva Glamazon. And I just want to focus on uh, self-care, encourage other people to join me, do it basically every day, wake up, no, I am going to do something good or nice for my body, whether that is just a target of five herbal teas a day, whether that is reading a book, something that makes you happy, that you consider self-care, that is good for you and your body, your mind, even if it's just, you know, having half an hour, just be in quiet for some women it can be clean the house and then just enjoying a cup of coffee in that clean house whilst kid, kids are still at school whatever that means to you so i thought i'm going to do this so today i did quite a lot i, did, I mentioned it i did my workout and um, quite decent one i did intermediate 30 minute class with a um, move with nicole which is just a dream i think she's my go-to when it comes to pilates at home and I just love it. I find her relaxing, straightforward. You know, it's the classes are super diverse and the best thing, it's free. I am looking also to sign up for a new studio that is here near me, I, it, within walking distance for Pilates classes. But until I sort out the nursery, I cannot do that. Um, because at the moment, if I don't know if she's going to get a nursery. That means I don't have any free days to actually go to do the class during the week. And normally the classes come within packages. So basically I, I didn't need to figure out how can I do two classes and Thai works really long hours. So that's just kind of update for my self-care guys. So maybe you guys want to join me on this journey, but I'm very, very serious about it and just really, really enjoy self-care and invest in myself so guys that's it i would love if you hit the subscribe button one of the shorter vlogs hopefully you enjoyed it and don't forget that everything is in the description box i'll see you soon Bye -bye.